they want closure, but you need to create your reality without them. Please scroll on if this doesn't resonate. Everything always works out for you. I'm supposed to get, encourage you with that because everything does work out for you. Someone tried to make you think it didn't. That they, you needed them. You don't need them. You don't need them. You are strong. You are strong. You are a magnet for abundance. I also pulled this card. That's what you are. And I think this person sees that in you. They want to be drawn to your abundance. They just want to step on you to make, make it seem like you're not worth anything. So when they steal your abundance, it won't matter. They've already beaten down your self-esteem if this is for you. I'm so sorry. I don't like that. In fact, let's rewrite that story for you. That I'm not here to keep you trapped in that world. I'm here to get you out of it. I'm here to acknowledge it just long enough to get you out of it. This person does not deserve you. And you already know who this is about if this is for you. Let's speak some things into your life and I want you to believe them. I want you to believe in faith that you have received them. I believe them for you. You deserve better than this. You are a magnet for abundance. I believe that for you. This person can't block your blessing, can't block your abundance anymore. You have positive thoughts. That's going to carry you through more than anything. I have learned the power of this myself. Positive thoughts will help you get out of a situation. I know I think we're afraid to have positive thoughts because we're afraid we're going to be stuck in a situation anyway, but I'm here to tell you, the gratitude, positivity, you'd be surprised how much you align with that energy. And then you find yourself out of the situation. Nothing is impossible for you. Nothing. Align yourself with the energy of what you want. If it's abundance, if it's freedom from a situation, start imagining your life with freedom. Create your reality in your mind. That's where it starts. That's what we're supposed to do. We're here to create a story. I'm here to help you rewrite or unwrite the story that someone else wrote for you. And a lot of people don't realize that's what happened. Anyway. It's time to create your reality without them. It occurs in your mind. You deserve this. You deserve this. You feel success all around you. They really did try to block your abundance, didn't they? They tried to block your success. I'm getting the energy of someone who you just really tried to beat you down because they knew all along that they were nothing compared to you. They knew all along that they couldn't. You were the brains of the operation. Put it that way. They've been trying to beat you down, and I don't think they realize they're doing it, so that's why it's better. You know, when it comes to this type of stuff, don't go arguing with a person and say, I figured you out, you're just trying to beat me down. They don't know they're doing it. It's low self-esteem on their part. Narcissists have the lowest of self-esteem. That's why they are narcissists. Like, it's not a high self-esteem thing. It's because they're so insecure. They have to, they just don't care who they destroy. As long as they get their way, they do not care. As long as it's all about them, they don't care what you give up for them. They don't care what they cost you, time-wise, money-wise, nothing. They don't care what trauma they put you through. They don't care what success they steal from you. But guess what? You feel success all around you. Do you realize, like, when I do this manifestation feel, do you know how powerful that is? The feeling is what draws it in. Sit and think about what success means to you. Just think about it for, like, five minutes. What would it look like in your life? What would it feel like? What would it smell like? What are you drinking on your most successful day? You get to go to a restaurant and order whatever you want. You're by yourself. Maybe you're waiting for a friend. And you're so happy to be there. Because you know what? You're successful. You feel success all around you. What are you drinking? I know it sounds crazy to say that, but that little piece of reality right there, that's how stories work. That's what we have to do to ground ourselves to the story. They call it writing with the five senses when you write a story. I've written fiction. It's all about the feeling. It's what you see. It's what you hear. It's all that stuff. The senses go into the feeling. What are you drinking? You're sitting at a nice restaurant waiting for a friend, ready to tell them all about how your great successful day went. You have no fear in your life. What are you drinking? For me, it's usually iced tea. <laughs> anyway, you feel success all around you. Money flows to you. They can't block anything from you. Nothing. You are grateful. Honestly, this is the fastest way to make your manifestations and make your prayers come true. Just thank the universe. Thank God in advance. Be like, thank you for what I've already received, even if you haven't already received it. Be grateful. Also, be grateful for what you already have. Because as soon as you start being grateful for even for the things you don't like, they'll start being replaced with other things. For real, it's happened to me. Anyway, you are grateful. It is spoken, it is written, and so it is. Amen.